Now let's get started, shall we? In order for any programmer to learn a language, there are four key things that you need to really master for any sort of language, including Python. First are the terms of that language. Sometimes a programming language has different words and different definitions for these words that you're going to have to memorize. Things like statements, variables, instantiation, really complicated sounding words, but you need to understand what they mean so that you can talk to other programmers. You also need to learn about a language's data type. That is, what sort of data can a program hold? You can think of it as values. Just like in real life, we have different ways to represent values, like numbers, letters, and symbols. In programming, we have these data types to store information. And each programming language has different sort of data types. Next, we need to learn about actions. At the end of the day, all programming is, is a way for us to tell our machines, hey, store this data, and then retrieve this data and perform some action on it. That's all it is, just using memory and performing some actions. So we're going to learn how to perform those actions. And then finally, we have to learn the best practices of each language. There's good ways of writing Python code and then there's bad ways. So that when we build our applications, our programs, well, we don't have a leaning tower like this, but we have a solid structure and a solid program. So throughout the course, we're gonna learn about these things, but keep this in mind. These four things are what you need to become a good programmer. And I wanna start the basic Python section with the data types. So let's get started.